What's up guys, this is Massey, welcome to another video. In this video I want to show you how to solve this expansion. It's 2x squared plus 3y squared to the power of 3. What we need to do, we need to have expansion like 3 choose 0, 2x squared to the power of 3, 3y squared to the power of 0, plus 3 choose 1, 2x squared to the power of 2, 3y squared to the power of 1 plus 3 choose 2, 2x squared to the power of 1, 3y squared to the power of 2, and finally 3 choose 3, 2x squared to the power of 0, 3y squared to the power of 3. So if we use triangles, as Pascal triangle, these three, these four coefficients is going to be 1, 3, 3, 1, or you can use the formula for that, which is when you have n choose r, it's going to be n factorial over r factorial and minus r factorial. Or you can use Pascal triangle. So this one is 1, 3, 3, 1. So that's going to be 1 times 2x squared to the power of 3. 3y squared to the power of 0 is going to be 1. Then you have 3 here. 2x squared to the power of 2 is going to be 4x to the power of 4. Then you have 3y squared to the power of 1 is going to be 3y squared. 3 choose 2 is going to be 3. 2x squared to the power of 1 is the same thing. 3y squared to the power of 2 is going to be 9y to the power of 4. This one is 1. 2x squared to the power of 0 is 1. So it's going to be 3y squared to the power of 3, which is 27y to the power of 6. So when you simplify, that's going to be 8x to the power of 6 plus 24x to the power of 4y to the power of 2. Then you have... 54x squared y to the power of 4, then you have 27y to the power of 6. Now, that's the final answer. If in case you have expansion of 2x squared minus 3y squared to the power of 3, what should we do? In these cases, that's going to be negative 3y squared. So this one you put negative 3y squared, negative 3y squared, same thing here, same thing here. This one to the power of 0 is, so it's going to be remain the same. This one is to the power of 1, so it's going to be negative. It's going to be the same as the plus 1, but it's going to be negative. This one remains the same. And this one again is going to be negative. So the answer is going to be 8x to the power of 6 minus 24x to the power of 4y squared plus 54x to the power of 2y to the power of 4 minus 27 y to the power of 6. That's going to be the expansion of 2x squared minus 3y squared to the power of 3. That's the final answer.